Hey there, I've been getting a lot of requests to do the uh, solo for Blue Collar Man, and even though I don't know it absolutely perfectly, I will do it anyway, and hopefully for those of you who know it less than me, this will help you. So um, it comes in like this. I'll break it down in a couple of pieces. First, first bit is like this. This whole solo is played in kind of in the tenth position, except for the last lick, which is the part I don't know perfectly. Uh, so I'm right here, uh, bending up on the twelfth fret of the G string for the first uh, intro lick, twelve to fourteen. You bend it up several times like that, and um, and actually I think in listening to it closely, you just picks it once and then keeps bending. That's the first lick. And then the next one is uh, starting on the 10th fret of the D string. Okay, so 10 and 12 to 10 of the G. And then you chromatically go down here 12, 12, 11, 10 slide to eight. And then you go, next bit is from the eighth fret of the low E string, sixth string. It's all that box position, minor pentatonic, essentially, based off the 10th fret box here. So, 8th fret of the low E string. Uh, that whole first section again at speed. Okay, next bit. Is up starts up on the 13th fret of the uh, of the B string second string and you bend it up here again all in the same position here so 13 up to 15 on the B and then 10 of the G and get some vibrato into this. Okay, that last lick. And then you do a double stop lick here from uh, the two strings you want to play are the G and the B string, third and second string, 12 and 10. Something like that. I struggle when I chop it all up. I got to kind of play it all together here. Okay, so that ends that piece. Now the next piece is uh, I'm going to play it down at the fifth fret. I'm going to start here. Uh, on the on the D string. So it's something like that. Here's where I go astray a little bit at this at this point. Uh, the the first note is. So you're on the fifth of the G, then fifth of the D, to hammer to seven, back to five of G. And then seven of the G, uh, bend it up. And then you just trill on five and open of the G. And then that bend there on the seventh uh, fret of the G string 
is the last bend before the very last section, uh, last bar, couple bars of the solo. And that piece goes like this. You hammer um, five to seven three times. So that is the last um, lick of the solo, and I think I'm doing that right, but I am not 100% positive that this is right. I am essentially going 7-5 open, 10-7 open, 7-5 open, 10-7 open on the G string. <laughs> And I'm not quite sure how many times he does that. And when you listen to it, you'll notice that he starts going slowly and then he kind of double times it for the last uh, couple of times. And then he bends to this note. And then he bends to this note. And you could do some little blues lick there to get you back to the D note to, uh, to the chorus of Long Nights. So there you go. There's a little broken down uh, Blue Collar Man solo. Really, really great solo. Thanks to you watching my channel who requested it. I hope that helps somebody out there play it a little bit better than you did before you watch the video.